morning and a blessed wonderful day to all of you friends wherever you are I pray for all your safety and protections also and thanks God I have a strength again today even though it's rough for me to sleep last night because uh, I had a very sore uh, stomach because of a lot of shots uh, two weeks in a row but uh, praise God I had still had a strength and it's so good that this will be my third week so for me to discharge so this it's all uh, my will be my last week so today I will be on the way to blood work again to draw blood to check and monitor everything will be fine and go smooth uh, before they will release my exit so that's a beautiful things here in the treatment because the doctor uh, will personally take care of you you know there are two doctors working each patient so that's all uh, great things so uh, you're really in a good uh, uh, spot so if you have a problem you can approach any time so I will get to the I will share to you what I, I will uh, have for my laboratory it's about uric acid organ disease panels and hematology and there are four here down that uh, my doctor checked which I cannot understand because it's all numbers only so so that's it I will be having and I will update some more to all of you please uh, subscribe follow so you will get some update of uh, what will happen again or about my therapy and treatment that's all for now see you all bye bye friends I'm here now at the clinic on the way to the door I will check in first touch the screen because here friend you need to check in uh, through electronic machine so that's why right here this is the process here so so that's the process here so they can see that you so so I'm done the check in complete I will be right back to all of you again with the update of my blood work. So I'm waiting for a call for my for the technician here. Hi friends, I'm here in my colon cleansing clinic so I can make a another uh, treatment here. So this will last 45 minutes so it helps me I'm so very tired today but I still had energy and strength I'll be right back to all of you later bye bye hi friends I'm here in colon cleansing I'm waiting because there's still a patient inside so I will tour you all you here look so, I guess so I'm here uh, waiting for the woman to call me this is a clinic this is the clinic of colon cleansing uh, this will be my third week uh, third week of my uh, treatment so last week now so will be this will be my last uh, treatment here so then I'm good to go back home uh, I'm so very tired a lot of needles stick to my body today left and right of arms drawing blood so but thankful I have full of energy at the end and it's still early I finish on time so that's the wonderful thing so uh, 
more updates to all of you uh, please uh, continue to follow share and subscribe so you will get uh, information about this alternative and integrative uh, medicine treatment see you bye -bye. hey friends I'm back uh, I'm on the way back to the clinic to let the nurse remove this IV port I'm, we're almost in a room but it looks it's getting uh, fatter and bigger so it's swollen and I know there's a uh, pain inside so I, I just decided to go back to the clinic since um, I know they're still open so I, the nurse can remove this IV port so before it become worse tonight so so far still uh, everything okay tonight friends and I will be right back to all of you hi friends I'm back good evening to all of you so uh, I had a very rough day friends but thankful I this I I made a final decision before the clinic closed to remove the IV it's a uh, better now this time the feeling is better now than I took the uh, anti-inflammatory a while ago but when you press, it's up to my elbow. It's really painful because it becomes swollen and fat a while ago. So, anyway, friend, I will have again you tomorrow. It's the, oh, uh, another IV port tomorrow. So, what can I do? We no choice. It's for my. Uh, it's part of the treatment. So, anyway, friend, I will give to all of you a short recap of what really happened to the treatment today. So the first thing in the morning, I'm so thankful that uh, I met up my first doctor to discuss a home uh, discharge instruction. So he gave me a home discharge instructions for, for my uh, treatment at home. So he gave me the oral supplements, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 oral supplements so to, uh, to maintain my immune system. So that's a uh, good thing because that's what a wonderful things here, friend. They work two kinds of doctor work personally about you about my case. So so he gave me you now the early home discharge instructions. So then he asked me if uh, because he remembered that uh, I told him that we had a clinic there who administer also IV uh, intravenous uh, uh, medicine. But there is no doctor, I said. There is only nurse. So I need the exact quantity. Then I will give, will tell the nurse. So he will administer. So he put here intravenous uh, naturopathics. It's a naturopathics medicine. The vitamin C is a high dose vitamins uh, for three months. Then we will, we will discuss because he said, well, I'm at home. We will do a communication monthly. So he will... We'll keep on talking what's the update and what happened. So it's a vitamin C, 60 grams. So I'm good at it. I will get it only two times a month. That's good. Then the, there's another protocol also. It's for six months and will be adjusted if necessary, like the ozone, the alpha-lophic acid, the artesanate IV. So it's CADOR. So uh, we will just discuss it this Friday, he said, because I will have test i will have my test tomorrow i guess or i know yeah tomorrow will be thursday so i will do the test to find out some uh as if all of you remember the scan to test the stress the functionalities of the bodies the of the organs the kidney the liver so he will do the test tomorrow which is good so that, but he put now here the instruction discharge so he will just adjust this and that's good so another the food diet i should be in a low sugar diet so that's why he put it Pres prescription pharmaceutical so low dose naltrexin naltrexon sorry okay so that's here the follow-up radiology laboratories and this protocol is for six months and will be adjusted if necessary so that's why he gave to me so so I'm so thankful friend that I can still continue my intravenous therapy in my state. 
so that's good uh, another one i met up also my second doctor so he discussed to me to give an update about the my thyroid so he, he said that i really had a autoimmune uh, thyroid problem but it's not a big issue so i, ca I cannot take a uh, any steroid medicine to shrink it down so until this time so i don't have any prescriptions for my goiter so he said we'll just wait while we're curing your cancer tumor we'll we'll see what happened to the tumor also because as is of all of you i said it's shrinking down for five five weeks of my treatment here and uh, alternative treatment so that's a, a beautiful news already a great news also already for me so another one I had a BRT bioregulator therapy in a flatbed hookup with electronic gadgets uh, regulate the body system and at the same time uh, uh, monitor by the doctor there because it hook up all to the computer system they are more on computer there so I had a dome also where it's a hot uh, metal uh, half or oh, uh, half semicircle size so it put on my stomach for one hour. So uh, I was there for one hour and one hour also at BRT so it almost two hours and two therapy only. And I got also a vitamin C high dose 60 grams. And it's very painful, very painful. That that's maybe the reason why it makes my arms swollen, swollen very fast. So, but I put it back now to normal after I took a lot of my medications here when I came back to our hotel. So I had a good lunch also, salmon, I taste good, and some berries, some fruits he gave to us. So that's all. So. <clears throat> That's all my friends. Uh, before I will end up this video, I want to say thank you again to all of you, my prayer groups. Uh, it's a, a very, very uh, great feeling, you know, that the Holy Spirit is working on me. Even though it's a rough day, the, my body is very tired, but at the end, and I woke up in the morning, I feel good. I don't feel any pain from my illness, from the tumor or cancer or nothing, but except for the pain on the shots. So I gave again a heart shots today, the auto, auto uh, hemo shot, very painful because the nurse extract again a blood on the left arms. I guess it's, I don't know how many mm, it's look for 5 mm for me, I forgot to ask. Then put back on my hips on the left side, until this time it's very sore. Very sore. So, two days in row, my body was full of shots. Uh, that's uh, what I feel, the pain, the sore, you know. But so far, praise God, I, had, I have only two days remaining. So after this, everything will back to normal. So thank you for all your supports and prayers because this uh, is a very rough treatment. But and but I'm on a path uh, way of be, being healed. So I can feel it. You know I can feel it. So. So far, uh, that's all my friends for tonight. And to, please continue to follow, uh, share, and subscribe so you will get an update of ki what kind of this treatment uh, I'm going through. And I still have more six weeks home program, so I don't know what will happen again, but I'm praying for the best and for the best of all the other patients there also, not only for me. So that's all. Have a blessed good evening to each and everyone.